next, it's a heavyweight title fight between Shane Carwin and the man who possesses some of the most lethal kicks in mixed martial arts history, Mirko Kroka. Mirko Kroka, set to enter the octagon and listen to the crowd. They love this guy. Mirko Krokop is one of the most successful strikers turned mixed martial artists of all time. He's got a ton of experience and quite possibly the most impressive highlight reel of knockouts you will ever see. Mirko Krokop, fired up and ready to give the crowd what they came to see. Shane Carwin, set to enter the world-famous octagon once again. Carwin is a knockout machine, and his first 12 MMA fights all ended with him putting his opponent away inside the first round. He's extremely athletic and was a highly decorated wrestler and football player in college. Shane Carwin, fired up and ready to go. Tale of the Tick is brought to you by Zenergy, powered by Zions, the official energy drink of the UFC. And now with our official introductions, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And now, live from the O2 Arena in London, England. It's time! Five rounds for the UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a striker. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 235 pounds, 16.8 stone. Fighting out of Zagreb, Croatia. This man is a former Grand Prix champion of five. Mirko Roka. And now, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler who stands six feet three inches tall. Weighing in at 250 pounds. 17.9 stone. Fighting out of Denver, Colorado. He is the former UFC interim heavyweight champion, Shane Carwin. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Dan Mergliata. All right, guys, this is for the UFC championship. I want a nice, clean fight. I want to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Touch gloves, come on out for you. Back to your point. Hi again, everybody. Mike Goldberg alongside Joe Rogan, and we are ready for round one. Are you ready? Are you ready? Mirko Krokop, Shane Carwin. And here we Let's go. go. Guys, this is it, Joe. The tournament final, and the UFC heavyweight belt is on the line. Both these guys looked extremely impressive in their semifinal matches, and they're coming in with a lot of fight left in them. They're both ready for this thing to turn into a war. Oh, beautiful hook! <laughs> nice job, double leg. Landing some good punches from this position. He lets him up. Hook there. Both guys staying in tight. Under three minutes now. Both men exchanging. They are exchanging here, Mike. Big right hand. 
Good leg kick. He's got the clinch. Oh! And again he goes for a ride. He's got half guard. Oh, reversal. Oh, he lets him up. Under 90 seconds remains in round one. Countering and scoring big time. Oh, answered by a big body shot. Just about one minute remains in the first round. 45 seconds remains. Trying to get the takedown. Nice sprawl. Good takedown defense. Nice counter. He takes him down again. Pushes him off with the feet. We've seen a lot of power shots getting countered by quicker strikes here, Mike. You can throw bombs all day, but if you're getting tagged by a faster fighter coming in, it'll throw you off over and over. Round one complete. Joe, both fighters seem determined to keep this fight standing. And the crowd here seems to appreciate a good striking match, Mike. 3-2, 3-2. He's looking for that uppercut. When you're throwing your punches and he's catching them, he's out wide, you can come up with the uppercut, okay? So after you throw a couple punches, that's the most uppercut. Let's check out some of the action from that round, Mike. This was well-timed here. Just a beautiful slip and counter. And here we see some amazing anticipation with a tremendous counter. Some good striking in that round, Mike. Okay, but I need a lead hook over him, not the backhand over him. And if it lands, then come back. There's the beautiful Ariani as we get set for round two. We start round two. Go, this Fight. fight's scheduled for five, five-minute rounds. Wow, that right hand. What an exchange here. Nice right hand. Carwin is cut open. Again, he takes him down. And he gets reversed. And he lets him back up. It looks like Krokop is cut as well, Joe. Carwin is fatigued. Oh, big overhand right. He caught the leg, and down he goes. He's back to his feet, but he's hurt. Oh, there's... Oh, oh beautiful combination. He's hurt. But he got rocked, but man, he snapped back quick. Oh, big shot, uh, Joe. He stunned him, Mike. Well, it looked like he was hurt, but he snapped back really quick. And now the crowd is favoring Shane Carwin. He shoots in. Again, the takedown is stuffed. Crow Cop is bleeding bad here. This does not look good. He what a huge right hand! Oh, he recovers. That is a pretty good sized cut now on Carlin, Mike. Inside leg kick. Checked. That's a huge left hand. Oh, he's even hurt more. He's down. Oh, but he recovers. Man, this crowd tonight really supporting Shane Carwin. And he cancers. Oh, big left hook. Two rounds in the books. Three rounds to go in this UFC title fight. Both fighters showing some pretty effective stand-up striking, Joe. Yeah, they seem to have no interest in going to the ground. 
He's backing up square, so the kick won't reach it. If you're gonna go, you're gonna go. Bop, 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 and hit it, okay? If you're if you're not... Movement's pissing him off, okay? Keep moving, keep moving. We just gotta get a little more active there today, okay? Keep that range. Uh, range. Let's take a look at the replay from that round, Mike. And here we're seeing that unbelievable shot that almost ended the fight. And here's that stunning counter punch. So well timed. Solid striking on display in that round, Mike. Hey, Just score. All you need to do is score. You score with that take. Ready to start round three. There's the beautiful Shandella. And we are set for the start of round three. This is a championship fight, so it is scheduled for five. Five-minute rounds. Body shot. Oh, beautiful left hook. He's rocked. Oh, big right hand. He's down. Oh, oh this one is getting ugly. Oh, he recovers. Oh, oh big shot from the top. Oh. Oh, but he recovers. Man, the cheers in here are deafening. This crowd is loving this. Stuffed. Nice counter right hand. Two minutes thirty. Good takedown to Oh, that's oh. a big shot. Oh, he's hurt, Mike. He's hurt bad. Look, it is all over. Wow. Man, that was nasty. We have a new. UFC heavyweight champion. Man, ground and pound 101. Yeah, let's take a look at the replay. Here you see him just standing over him, just pounding his face in. Referee had no choice but to step in and stop the fight. And with our official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 49 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by TKO. And now, the new UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Mirko. Mirko Trokop is the new UFC heavyweight champion.